welcome back. Today I just really wanted to talk about uh, a follow-up to the depression video. And it's been um, almost five weeks. And, um, you know, first of all, I want to thank you guys for reaching out because so many of you shared your stories with me and I had no idea how many people were in the same situation. And some of you have been seeking treatment and some of you haven't and that's okay. Um, but I encourage you to do something to actively take care of this situation. Um, for me, once I got on um, the meds, I think I was numb really for the first uh, four weeks and it wasn't until really last week that I felt like I turned a corner. Um, prior to that, my emotions were very neutral, very flat line. <laughs> there were no highs, there were no lows, but I, the anxiety had eased up a little bit. Um, and then finally, after the fourth week, I feel a little different, like I'm able to feel joy and happiness. And, you know, I always pray, God, give me something to talk about in my videos. And something did happen, something very, very sad, very tragic. And I talk a lot about things that go on, you know, at work. And I did come across a situation. And instead of crying and breaking down like I normally would do, I was able to have a conversation with that person. And that's exactly what I wanted to do. So it does take that sensitivity away from me where I would constantly be crying if I hear a sad story or I see something sad, or even if I watch TV and I have not cried. <laughs> I think since I've been on the meds. So that's been a really great discovery because as I talked about in uh, my self-acceptance video, that was one of the things that I really, really hated was, you know, if something was going on, I was so emotional that I just couldn't express my sympathy or um, show comfort and compassion to people because I had to put up a wall because I was just way too sensitive and I would just start crying and I'd have to walk away. So in this recent situation, it didn't occur to me until after I'd gotten home and I was like, wow, I was able to have a conversation with that little boy. I didn't even cry. I didn't, um, it's, you know, I felt sympathy and empathy and compassion, but I didn't break down in tears and just become this useless person. So that's like one of the best things to come out of this. And the other thing I noticed too is I'm very chill, very relaxed, and I think I had a lot of patience before, but I was lazy. And um, that sort of laziness has waned. Um, my patience is much better than it was, even though I didn't feel like I had no patience, but I guess apparently maybe I had a few issues. I don't know. But I'm very, very chill. Um, I even drive slower. <laughs> I'm just not always, that, that feeling inside of you where you're just anxious all the time. I gotta get there, I don't wanna be late, you know, what's traffic gonna be like? Like I don't have that anymore. I'm just very relaxed and very chill. And I realize if I'm a minute or two late, it's gonna be fine. Um, you know, you put these, these restrictions on yourself. You really do. You put that pressure on yourself. And um, I just, I'm very happy with the results. Now, if we had done this video two weeks ago, I don't know how I would have been. But um, like I said, you got to give it time. I think it says six to eight weeks to really get the full effect. So I think I just turned the corner right now here at uh, week week four. Actually, I'm going into week five. So I've just now turned the corner. So it's been a um, so far a positive experience. I mean, there's been some side effects, nothing major, nothing long term. Um, you know, I would imagine your body needs to get used to to lots of things. So um, anyway, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for being there, and you know holding my hand through this and being so open and honest about your stories. And I'm just so glad I finally reached out and I finally got help. I really, really am. And I thank you so much. Um, ironically, this, this whole thing kind of happened while I was doing um, my vlogs. <laughs> you know, God has a plan, I guess. So I, I hope that you're getting help if you need it. Um, 
thank you, thank you, thank you for sharing your story and your journey with me. I do appreciate it. Um, just wanted to make sure I followed up with you guys because I did promise that I would. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Take care. Much love and subscribe and share with friends. Thank you. See you next week.